Hello my friends. Today we are going to the vast vegetable farms in the United States to see how the process of cultivating and harvesting millions of tons of vegetables happens. According to statistics released from the United States Department of Agriculture in 2021, the area under vegetable cultivation in the country is 2.3 million hectares and the yield is about 40.3 million tons. Currently, there are more than 40 different varieties of vegetables grown in the United States. Amongst them, potatoes, tomatoes, sweet corn, and lettuce are the most produced vegetable varieties. The first place we will visit is a celery farm in the state of Arizona. Each year, this nursery also supplies about 167 million celery plants to farms in Arizona. Between April and May is the time when millions of celery plants are grown on farms in Arizona. These workers will grow about 39,000 celery plants per acre. According to statistics, in 2021, the area under cultivation of celery in the United States is 35,000 acres, of which California is the state with the largest celery growing area with 28,000 acres. The time from planting to harvesting celery lasts about 140 to 150 days, depending on the climate of each region. This is the celery harvest that is taking place on a farm in California. Millions of celery plants will be cut and placed in plastic trays. Every October is the time when more than 4,000 workers flock to California celery farms to harvest. These workers work about eight hours a day and their average salary is about $13 an hour. At this farm, the celery plants, after being harvested, will be washed, packed and shipped immediately to the vegetable stores. In 2021, celery production in the United States is 1.1 million tonnes. Here's what's going on at a green bean farm in Salinas City, California. Every August is the time to harvest green beans in California. At this time, about 1,600 workers flock to these farms to pick green beans. In 2021, the green bean acreage in the United States is about 200,000 acres, of which Wisconsin, Florida, Michigan and California are the states with the largest cultivation area, accounting for 80% of the country's green bean growing area. Millions of green beans will be picked and placed in plastic trays. Next, they will be poured by this man into boxes with a weight of about 22 pounds each. In 2021, US green bean production is 929,000 tonnes and Wisconsin accounts for 37% of the nation's green bean production. The third place we will visit in this video is a broccoli farm in California. Currently in California, 119,000 acres of land is used to grow broccoli accounting for 90% of the country's broccoli growing area. These workers will plant about 23,000 broccoli plants per acre. After about 95 days from planting, the millions of broccoli plants here are ready to be harvested. Currently, the harvesting process at all broccoli farms is done by hand because there are no harvesters compatible for this vegetable. 
millions of broccoli will be picked and packaged on the farm before being shipped to the grocery store. In 2021, US broccoli production is approximately 2.1 billion pounds and the yields are over $750 million in value. Next, we will go to onion farms in the United States to see how the process of cultivating and harvesting billions of pounds of onions happens. Mid-March to early April is when onion seeding takes place in the large fields in Washington, California and Oregon. Currently, about 127,000 acres of farmland in the United States is used for onion production. The time from sowing to harvesting is about 115 days. This is the process of growing onions on a farm in Idaho. The beginning of August each year is when the harvest takes place on most large-scale onion farms in the United States. Millions of onions will be harvested by this machine. They then will be transported by truck to the packing plant. In 2021, US onion production is 3.9 million tons and brings in a value of nearly $1 billion. This is the process of harvesting onions on a farm in California. Here, millions of onions are cut by hand and then packed in bags before being shipped to the factory. On average, each worker who harvests onions here will receive about $80 US per day. And here's what's going on at a coriander farm in Texas. Dozens of these workers will cut the coriander and bundle it into small bundles. It will then be loaded onto trucks. We are currently on a lettuce farm in Arizona. Each year, more than 5,000 workers flock to the lettuce farms in Arizona to harvest. Currently, Arizona has about 54,000 acres of land used to grow lettuce and the value that this vegetable brings each year is about $310 million. The final location in the video is a beetroot farm in Minnesota. How do you feel about the process of harvesting and cultivating the vegetables shown in this video? Please let us know what you think in the comments section of the video. Hello everyone, today we are going to the fields of sweet corn in Florida and Washington state of the United States. Here, we will see how the farmers here cultivate and harvest billions of sweet corn. In the United States, sweet corn seeding usually takes place in March and April each year. Currently, the United States is home to the largest sweet corn crop in the world with about 268,000 acres and an annual harvest of 
billion pounds. After the sowing process is over, these sweet corn fields will be supplied with water with this modern irrigation system. On average, each high yielding corn crop uses about 600,000 gallons of water per acre. Sweet corn is a fast growing plant. The time from sowing to harvest usually lasts around three months. There are even some sweet corn varieties that only need two months to be harvested. Some sources claim that sweet corn was cultivated by Native Americans more than 7,000 years ago in Central America. According to statistics released in 2021, each American uses about 4.7 pounds of sweet corn and the revenue from sweet corn production is about $774 million. Do you enjoy using sweet corn in your daily meals? After about three months, all the sweet corns here are ready for harvest. Millions of sweet corn will be picked and then sent to the factory for packaging. This is the process of harvesting sweet corn on large farms. Millions of corn will be picked by this modern farming machine. This is what goes on at a sweet corn packing plant. If you don't like to eat sweet corn the usual way, you can use canned sweet corn.
how do you feel about the process of cultivating and harvesting sweet corn in this video? Let us know what you think in the comments section of the video. Goodbye and see you in the next video.